Okay, guys, hello. Um, today I'm going to be filming a the plan with me for my vacation that's coming up, which is always a fun time. And um, as I mentioned in previous videos, I'm going to be using a Paris kit. I'm going to Spain. I know it's a little weird that I'm using a Paris kit, but I just like I just chose this because it's very, very, very full coverage and um, decorative, so I won't have a ton to cover up. But wait, does that make sense? Like, I'm not going to have a lot to fill in for these days because I'm on vacation, so I wanted something that I could use, because I would never use this kit just during the week because it doesn't have enough room for me to write in all of my plans. So I'm using it now, if that makes sense. But this kit is also, it's like Paris theme, but it's also very like celebratory. So I know like a lot of people use this even for just their birthday or something. Okay, so I'm kind of trying to do it how she has it. on her Instagram. All right. And then what does she have up here? She has one of the full boxes, maybe. I don't know what that is. Oh, it's this box. All right, so let's just put that up here. That fits perfectly. You can see a tiny bit of the march right there, but oh well. So, I'm trying to see if she has like a full open picture of it. It's a little confusing. This was one of her like, I don't want to say her first kit, but definitely, um, a, one that she made a long time ago. Even when I bought it, I had just seen it on her Instagram. Oh, this is going to be an issue. Oh no. Are all of these like that? No. One of the stickers won't peel up. So yeah, right now I'm just going to put down all of the checklists and these um, I will probably just use for like uh, marking what I did during the vacation, things like that, instead of actually like to-do lists. Okie dokie. So there's that. And I'm still going to put the to-do headers on top just because um, there she doesn't have any other headers. So yeah, she just has these donut things over top, I believe. 
So let me do that. And then she has like little fans that say to do. Or no, these are not donuts. These are macarons or macaroons, however you want to say it. I love, I say macaroons, but people have told me that's like the wrong way to say it, but oh well. But I love them. They're so delicious. Um, I traveled to Paris, London, and Nice, France, um, after my high school graduation. And I wish I would have been into planning then. I just wasn't. I don't, I don't know. When did I get into planning? After my freshman year of college. So, yeah, I had no idea that the planning world even existed then. So I wish I would have known because this kit is adorable and I could have used it for when I actually went to Paris. But it's okay. I'm getting its use now. So then she just had these to-do fans kind of um, in the center of those. It was kind of like going as I see fit because I don't know, um, you know, these kits are hard to put down because they're very non-traditional. So, um, kind of have to play around with it. And obviously I'm going by her picture a little bit. Oh, that one was not centered, but let's see if it'll come up. better. Okay. I love the way her stickers feel. So now let's see. So she just has three full boxes. Okay. Let's go ahead and put down the bottom washi which I think perfect and then I'm guessing this goes over on the other side she only has a picture of like one side It's pretty though. So now I guess let's just do this side because that is the side I can see on her little thing. Am I missing a page? Um, I feel like I'm definitely, oh no I'm not. JK, JK. Okay. Let's put down some full boxes. And these go right underneath the checklist. Perfect. Then we have a... Yeah, her sticker quality is definitely improved since I bought this. Um, some of the stickers are having a little trouble peeling up, but I love her shop. It's actually one of my favorites. And they're actually fairly easy to peel up, which is super nice because with a kit like this you never know if you're gonna make a mistake um, so that's really nice alrighty and then over here we have this cake double box sorry guys my camera shut off but um, I put down some of the full boxes including that little double box right there with the cake and I suppose I'll just go in and put 
the last two full boxes here that I have. Okay. So then here's the interesting part. Um, they have the Eiffel Tower over here, which I guess I could go ahead and put that down. It's adorable. And I just kind of have it lined up like here. That's good. That's adorable. Gosh, I love that. Okay. Oh, this kid. So now they have a big carriage right here that says notes. So that's right there. Let's put our weekend banner down super quickly. So it goes over here. Um, and then they have these little mirrored things over there, which I guess that's the same way I'll do it. Um, cause I don't think the carriage would look good here. So yeah, let's just do that. So I'm going to put down these last little full box type thingies over here. I love these ones. They look like glitter confetti like coming up. It's adorable. I'm also kind of filming this at a weird angle, so that probably doesn't help. But I'm trying to like fix my lighting. Um, because as I'm sure you guys know, it's not the best in this little dorm room, so I'm struggling, but I'm trying to figure it out. Perfect. So, let's see here. Oh, that's cute. Beautiful. Now let's do our last little full boxes over here, and then we can go into, like, um, deco and stuff. And these will actually be pretty cool. These kind of work as like half boxes in my opinion. These little round circle thingies. Um, which is kind of cool because I can write in like um, went to wine region or like whatever we do. Um, so I think that'll be nice for those down there. And then here... Like I said, I can always use up the checklist up there for that sort of thing as well. And then I also like that little notes section. So yeah, now all we really have to do is deco. Um, so they have this cute little banner that she had put right here, which I thought was adorable. Right in the cake. Let's see. Yeah, a lot of people use this for their birthday. Um, and this even, that's what I was going to say earlier, but I got in the kind of zone of decorating. But what I was going to say is this kit, when I even bought it, and I bought it early summer, um, she didn't have it in the shop, but I had just seen it on her Instagram. So I messaged her and said, is there any way that you could that I could buy this Paris kit, and she was like, oh yeah, of course, and I wasn't expecting her to say yes, honestly, um, so I was kind of blown away, but she did, which was super nice. I don't think I want to use the fan. Let's use... I love dogs. If you know me, you know I'm obsessed with dogs. So I'm going to use as much as these little doggies down here as possible. Just 
and then we'll do like the little macaroons like he's looking at them and longingly that's cute and then we'll do this little pink doggy down here And then the last one, we'll put right here. So cute. And then we also have this little candy jar. Put that right here. And then we have a lot of little Eiffel Towers. But these stickers are kind of frustrating me because they don't want to peel up exactly right. I'll do a couple, but I don't want to overwhelm the spread with Eiffel Towers. So I think those are the only two I'll do. And then... I don't know, like they're peeling up like the paper. Like I said, I think she's definitely changed her um, sticker paper and things like that since... I bought this kit, but I think that's all I'm going to try to put down just because the stickers are kind of frustrating. Um, the mat, like, none of them want to peel up correctly, and it takes a little time. So I think I'm just going to let that go. <laughs> but um, that is an adorable spread, guys. Oh my goodness, how gorgeous is this? And like I said, it feels so good. It's like a little less thick than Caress, pa Caress Press. Um... It's like not as thick, I would say. Like the paper is not as thick, but the feel is like buttery like that. I love it. So yeah, I'm really obsessed with this kit. It's literally unlike anything I've ever done in my planner at all. Like it's so different. Like color scheme, I'm just obsessed with it. And I'm excited to kind of like play around with this when I get back from my trip to... Um, write in like what we did while we were there and everything so I think that'll be really fun um and I don't have much left from the kit at all I used pretty much everything except for some of the deco so yeah but I hope you guys enjoyed this video even though it was a little um not traditional, you know, but, um, sometimes those are my favorite videos to watch because they're different. So hopefully you guys enjoyed it. And, um, if you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below if you're not already. And I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye everyone.